executing slaughter sequence number two. Belay that! These are our allies. For now. We can hear you, you know. Anyway, you done tinkering yet? There! All done! Now we- We leave right now. Excellent! To Bacchanawa! <laughs> what the? What did you pack? Rocks? Just brought a few potion materials to be on the safe side! And some lab equipment and safety equipment and- Bah! Whatever! You're lucky I overcompensated for how heavy you lot are fourfold! Rude assessment of our weight aside. Engage! As you wish, sir. <laughs> Analysis complete. Sensors confirm a code black compatibility of 91%. <laughs> Brilliant! Then I'm heading straight for the power core! You mean you know how to get there? Um. Right. Of course not.
Okay? Roger, roger. I am unable to contact Serpentine or Mila. Sorry, sorry. I was just unpacking my thing. You do realize the urgency of our situation, correct? Chill out, scary lady. Some of us need a pick-me-up. Fine, but be quick.
you guys get it? Murga's going to blow up the moon. That's kind of terrible. You think I don't know that? Of course I do. Thought I could stick fire until it all made sense again, but having Bakanawa eat the moon, that's just nuts. Murga was supposed to give a voice to us outsiders from all over the world. Instead, she's just going to destroy everything. Whoa, that was a sudden change of heart. The two-timing traitor turncoats twice. Ha! Yeah, I chose the wrong side, I admit it. But I don't want any part of this. You want to get slaughtered? You go right ahead. Murga's even more powerful now, and she's not in the mood for visitors. Huh, where did short stuff go? So, you've been there for how long now? Oh, a while. Ah, and I have friends now. Short stuff's name is... Ah... Hey, friend! What's your name? Ah! See? But, you know what? Forget it. I'm happy to drop this subject now. You sure he's okay? I just want to see space and do awesome science! Science buddies! Oh, no. There's two of them now. Just keep him out of trouble, by which I mean no building robots.
just can't shake you, can I? Help us, Cory! I'm begging you! Corazon, Corazon take, take her, her down. down! What? No, that wasn't the deal! You promised protection! Protection, protection that I will rescind, will rescind if you don't, you don't find, find a way to control, control your, sister. your sister! Do it, Do now, it now, or I will, or I will silence, silence her rebellion, rebellion myself! myself. Cory... I... don't have a choice now. You should have stayed away! figured out. The world is toast. But at least I could have saved us. You just had to go and mess it all up. Newsflash, Cory. If Murga destroys the moon, then what are we going to do? Play card games while we watch the world drown? At least we'd have each other. Seriously? When did you become such a coward? Maybe the fight is hard. Impossible, even. But I'd rather go out fighting alongside my friends than help a giant fish lady kill the world. That's like Common Sense 101! <laughs> Always the blunt one. <gasps> no! No, 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 no! I'll kill you! Don't be selfish, child. Your sister wanted the two of you together, and now you are. Leave this ship, and you may yet have time to save her. Mila, come in! I'm bringing my sister! She needs help! Okay, I'll get my supplies! Is she gonna be okay? She should be fine. I gave her a double dose of some of my strongest potions. It might make her a little... Oh, everything tastes like raisins! Yeah, she'll need to rest for a while.
loads of vermin. This ship is now under the command of General Serpentine! I hate to disappoint my former allies, but in light of my desire to leave this wretched planet, the moon harvesting will proceed as planned! That's a relief! Now we don't have to play Betrayal Musical Chairs! I was getting super confused! Uh, hello? He's still gonna blow up the moon? Stick with the plan. We need to stop Bakunawa no matter who's in charge.
dog! Sick him! War dog? Huh? Me? Yes! You! Do you see any other traitors around here? Um, well, honestly, I didn't think you'd make it this far. Oh, what a surprise! Betrayed by the very pup I trusted to betray her friends. Ha! Too bad for you! I have prepared for every contingency! In this game of chess, I hold all the cards! Um, that's not how you- This dog is a traitor to you by birthright! It doesn't matter if she refuses to fight for me! After all, we hail from the same planet! The homeland of the magnificent Lord Brevin! What? Mila's from wherever he's from? That would explain a lot, actually. Of course! We even made a deal for her to go home, in exchange for slaughtering the lot of you! No! I... I mean... I guess it's true about me not being from this planet! And I'm not a traitor! I'm... I'm not a monster! That's right. Whatever the opposite of a monster is, that's what you are. Thank you. I'm not going with you, Serpentine, and that's final! Four of a kind! Checkmate! Syntax! Resonance Link! <laughs> Mila! Alright, Snake Man, get ready for Punch Central! Well, no matter. 
With Code Black installed, I can simply flood this chamber with my robots! Then we'll see who has the last le- No! No! What happened? A bold move, General. But the will of Bakunawa has been restored. You have ten seconds to leave. Gotta go! That... that felt good. That felt really good. Look out, world! There's a new Mila in town! <laughs> so, would it be okay if old Carol asked new Mila for potions? Oh, sure! No problem! And, um, thank you again for believing in me.
You should have run. Let there be no more death today, Murga. This planet should not have to suffer for the sins of my people. Hollow words from a boy who grew up in a palace built on those sins. I know that the Earth Dragons, my people, had enslaved your own. I know of the accidental test fire of Bakanawa's mining laser killing thousands of water dragons in the blink of an eye. All these events and more were excised from history by Earth Dragon hands. I apologize for my complicity through ignorance. You think that a mere apology can erase our suffering? No. And that is why I intend to bring this secret history to light. Tell the world what really happened, and venerate the water dragon's struggle against my people's tyranny. Everyone will know what the Earth Dragons have done. Please, let this world live. <laughs> to be remembered as slaves who rebelled against their masters and lost? Or the monsters that killed the world? What choice do I really have as the one final breath of the Water Dragons? Wait! You don't have to- Oh right, giant fish lady. Time we finish this. The blood of my people has been spilled. And there is but one way to repay that. <laughs> Your suffering will be a masterpiece. Blue Moon!
Eclipse. No! 
The Earth Dragons must suffer! The Water Dragons will have justice! I will have my revenge! Parameters met. Initiating playback. Hello again, love. I pray that you'll hear these words somehow. Because... I know that this isn't all we'd hoped for. And I'm so sorry. What a... Marie. I wish I could be there with you right now. We had some... But I hope that no matter what happens, you'll find your own happiness. No. There has to be more. There has to be something else. Play it again! Bring her back! Bring her back! Please. Please, I just want to see her one more time. Please. You know, if she cared about you, I don't think she would have wanted to see you like this. Syntax! I thought we blasted her off the ship along with Serpentine! Code Black, version 2 initiated. Termination protocols initiated. Mode harvesting to commence as scheduled. Something's coming this way! How many times are we gonna have to save the moon before it stays saved? Keep up your spirits, Wildcat. Let us put a stop to this. Go. I won't resist. I have much to think about.
Started this. It's only right that I end it as well. All right, girls, let's finish this. me.
by the collective efforts of our three kingdoms, the threat of Makanawa has come to an end. Yet as the moon we defended so passionately fades into the horizon, I cannot help but dwell on the unsettling truth that has been revealed to us. Is punishment enough for conspiracy to silence an entire world? Will an act of forgiveness lead to peaceful resolution? Or will it buckle under the weight of those unwilling to change? Perhaps there is no perfect answer. Nevertheless, I feel it is my duty to pursue an outcome that I believe would break the cycle of conflict that has consumed our world for generations. The atrocities of our past should never be forgotten, but neither should they be repeated. Under regular circumstances, our laws would pronounce your deeds to be acts of war, and in the former sergeant's case, treason. Such crimes would be punishable by life in prison, or even death. However, these are not regular circumstances. In light of certain facts that have been brought to light, the severity of your punishments will be reduced. I hereby sentence the four of you to six months of community service. You will remain in Shang Tu for the duration of your sentence to clean up the mess caused by your callous disregard for our property. And you better do a good job. Those fossils in the museum ain't gonna rebuild themselves, you know. As you wish. Captain Kalau will do as the Hammer of Justice wills. Well, on the bright side. I guess you get to see me more often, sis. As for your ringleader, we have found neither hide nor tail of Murga in Bakanao's wreckage. We would have offered her clemency in the same manner as you. But I strongly suspect she would not have cared for an Earth Dragon's ruling. And now I declare this ruling to be concluded. General Gong will hand out your assignments. Nira, may I have a private word with you and your friends? How fair is Sash Lilac? She hasn't woken up yet. She's strong, though, so I wouldn't be surprised if she's up and about in a day or so. That is good to hear, and thank you, all of you. Once again, the day is saved thanks to your efforts. Pshaw! Saving the world, no worries! Well, actually, Scary Lady here was new to all this, but we showed her the ropes. Yes, however would I have survived without your apt tutelage? See? She even picked up a sense of humor! There is... something else. Now that we are aware of the full facts behind my people's rule and abuse of power, it would be disgraceful to continue as if nothing has changed. Which is why I am stepping down as the leader of Shang Tu. What? No, Magister, you can't! I must. If change is to happen, then it has to come from within. We will take a page from our neighboring city and appoint a new leader through free elections. In the meantime, a regent must be appointed to oversee the proceedings are fair and just. I was hoping that you would fulfill that role, Nira. Me? Uh, what? I mean, it makes a lot of sense. Who's the most honorable person we know who'd protect and defend Cheng Tu at all costs? Yeah, and we have the freeze burns and jail time to prove it. Seriously, though, innocent until proven guilty next time. I... I would be honored, but... Surely there are others just as loyal. Perhaps. But none of them have battled a Water Dragon Centurion on a spaceship that was about to eat the moon. That is both a rare sentence and achievement. In that case, it would be my honor to accept this duty. I will not fail our people, nor leave our lands undefended. Excellent. Then I pronounce you Regent Nira Lee of Shang-Tu. 
Yeah, Major Congrats, Scary Lady. I mean, Regent Scary Lady. Thank you. But what will you do now, Magister? There is still so much history lost or hidden away by the Earth Dragons. My intention is to roam the world of Avalis to try and document what remnants may remain. But for now, get some rest, and I shall prepare what duties lie ahead of you as Regent. Ah! Uh, I can't believe this! These assignments are complete Delta Sierra! What's up, Cory? This whole boondoggle is what? I thought we were getting it easy, but not only do I have to repair the palace brick by brick, the Sigwad is getting recommissioned to be an official part of the Perusian Air Force! I thought you worked for Perusa anyway. Yeah, but not officially! Everyone's trying to tie me down, I swear! <laughs> so that means for the next six months, I'm gonna be seeing you around the palace a lot, right? You know what that means! Oh no. Carol, please. Mercy. Was I really that bad a sister? Aw, it's okay, Cory. I know I was a crane in the neck. What's that? Oh, it has begun. Nailed it! Honestly, us spending so much time together is gonna cement our relationship. La 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 la! Aw, uh -huh, come back! I was just building up to my good material! Hey, sure you should be moving around so much? Where are you going? I heard that they never found Murga, so that's what I'm going to do. I think she deserves to know that someone's thinking of her and make sure she's okay. Same old lilac. Can't you be a little Miss Hero Pants some other time? <laughs> Not a chance. Besides, this might be my only chance to find out more about the water dragons. And maybe even something about my parents. Cool. I gotta stay and make sure my sister does all right. Mila and Scary Lady have got their own things going on, too. You gonna be okay by yourself? Of course. Even a falling spaceship isn't enough to stop a dragon. <laughs> Fair enough. Catch you later, Lilac. Later, Carol. Lila! You guys got here a little late. She's gone off to find Murga. Oh, last of the water dragon's business? Ah, so she's pulling a Carol. I see. You guys are never gonna let me live that down, are you? Never. When do you think she'll come back? Given her inclination towards heroics, I would presume we would merely have to weather some kind of alien invasion, and she would come running back. You're not wrong there. I could put on a cape, laugh maniacally, and declare my plan to conquer the world. Please do not.
again, love. It's me, Cordelia. I pray that you'll hear these words somehow, because it will mean that you've been freed from your crystal prison. I know that this isn't all we'd hoped for, and I'm so sorry. What happened to the water dragons was a travesty, and the passage of time has not been kind to their memory. I wish I could be there with you right now. We had so much ahead of us. But I hope that no matter what happens, you'll find your own happiness. And who knows? Perhaps we'll even be together again. Someday. But for now, my work isn't over. Not yet. End entry.